with a quick break. And you see what we got down there? I got two uh, blaster boxes here of 2024 Heritage Baseball there. So you know I'm a huge collector of Heritage. And I thought I'd do a quick little break here. I had these two laying around. I figured I'd open them up. So nothing wrong with the retail. You got to get the retail for your master sets. Uh, there's the 75 Zoos Who. So I'll be looking for that. Uh, we got the foil board. Haven't got one of those yet. So it'll be kind of nice to get one of those. And of course, there's the inserts. We need the single prints still. This is a good way to get single prints. Hobby boxes, there's about eight. You can get two to three out of these, and it's a lot cheaper. So it's kind of why I open these every once in a while. So we got two here we're going to open up. We're going to use the lucky coin of chance. We've got heads. We've got tails. There we go. Good luck. What are we going to get here? We're going to get tails. We're going to open up that one first. Why not? Oh, here we go. I got my guy for screwdriver here. Just a quick, fun break. Figure I'd do this here. Oh, I love collecting my heritage. Got a whole bunch more heritage coming up here for you heritage fans. I try to do this every other week or so. So if you're a huge heritage fan, why don't you subscribe to my channel and we'll have fun opening this stuff up. So we're getting close to 900. Now there we go, that's what they look like. And we won't go all through all the names. Oh, here we go. We'll go Taylor Ward of the Angels there. Some love there. So there you go. That's what they look like. There is the back. You're looking for the short print low number cards, one through 100 this time. So uh, I usually put them backwards. So we don't have to worry about it nowadays. But in the older ones, you did. Oh, there's Manny Machado there from the Padres. And it looks like we're going to get our first single print low number card there. We got the highlights there. 200th win. We got old man Kershaw there. Clayton Kershaw. There you go. Mesmerizes bets with 200th wins. Show the price. Show the odds on these blaster boxes. So getting a short print right from the get-go. I'm loving it. I need it. Oh, that one I do. I'm pretty sure I need that one for sure. Oh, here we go. Oh, call your favorite players as we go through this. Oh, Francisco. 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 That's fun to say. Francisco. Met some love, and it looks like we're gonna get an ace a base pack here. Unfortunately, uh, we're gonna get some ace base there. We're showing the Swedish girl. We just want the good stuff. Get rid of those ace of base packs early. There's Charlie Blackman, he just retired there, so I'll get some give him the nods for the Rockies. And here we go. Looks like we're gonna get something here, and we're gonna get a new age performer of. Fernando! That is Junior El Nino. There you go. Get some El Nino action there from the Padres. Fernando Tatis Jr. there. I love that guy. So there you go. From the Padres there. Uh, there is our first insert card of the box. Uh, there we go. Uh, call it your favorite player as always. And it looks like we're going to get, oh, there's an the evil guy, Craig Crimble there. Oh, uh, there's up next. We got another short print right there of Gunnar Henderson. So getting a good card there. Pretty sure I need him. Uh, there you go. Get a short print card of Gunnar Henderson. Uh, there you go. Beautiful card right there. So we'll take that. There's good old Vinny from the Royals. Good player there. Royals made the playoffs. So did my Tigers. Had a good celebration over the weekend because of my Tigers. Get some Tigers love. We got get some Tigers love here today. Oh, uh, and it looks like we're going to get an ace, a base pack. Uh, ace, a base. I don't think there's any like red or blue parallels in here. Uh, they're just regular, you know, regular. Uh, blaster boxes so hopefully we're out of ace of base no one wants ace of base and here comes our next one we got a then and now i love then and now it's been a staple in heritage forever we got burt by 11 there and spencer strider of the braves there you go then and now burt by 11 of the twins pretty sure i got that one there's good old shoney otani there home runs leaders from 2023 and matt olson of the braves so here we go uh, looking for the inserts. There's Josh Young there with the Rangers there. Very nice card. I'll uh, get some of those MVP cards staple there from 75 and now. So there it is from uh, 
that, 1951? Yep, 51 most valuable players. And we're going to get another sharp print card. So we're getting the sharp prints out of here, which I'm not I'm not minding one bit. Like I said, you get two to three. And there's Joey Weimer there from the brew crew there, Milwaukee Brewers. Look at his flowing blonde hair there. There you go, go for your brew crew lovers. Number 56. So there we go. We've got our three short ring cards. That's what I'm looking for. I know people want all the good cards. If you're a master set collector, you need those short prints, and I need them bad. So here we go. 2024 featuring the beautiful 75s. You gotta love this one. My favorite sets. And unfortunately, oh, we did get an insert. That is a retail insert. The pink cards there. We got Thurman Munson there. All the Yankees. Get some good Thurman Munson action. Oh, there you go. So that is the retail exclusive. Those pink parallel cards there. Or pink cards, pink insert cards. Oh, there you go. Beautiful, beautiful card there of a retro player himself, Thurman Munson. We'll take that. Yeah, you need the. That's why you got to open up the retails as well. Uh, you, you want, you need the retail exclusive if you are a master set collector. And unfortunately, I am. Or fortunately, I think I'm fortunate. I love it, gives you something to look forward to. Now, opening these up can be so fun if you're a master set collector and say, hey, I don't have that card. I need that card, especially those short prints. So here we go. Probably the only one that likes the short prints. There's the managers. There's Whitey Herzart of the Royals. Kind of weird to see him in a Royals uniform. Always imagine him with the Cardinals all those years. So there's Bobby Witt Jr. Get some more Royals love there for your Royals fans. Uh, let's go. Looks like we're going to get an insert in here. And there he is. There's Manny Machado there of the San Diego Padres. So another new age performer there. Show the price. Show the odds. Oh, there you go. That is our first insert. Yeah. You can get a bunch of base cards of good, you know, good players. So, but you want the good stuff here. So, here comes there's Reese Olsen there, great pitcher for the Tigers. Got some Tigers love there, and here comes our next single print low number card, number forty six. We got Jake Rogers of the Tigers. Got my Tigers love there. That guy is a hoot and a half. I love this guy. I have a great, great card of him. Uh, I'll have to show that off on those days. Got awesome autograph of him. Jake Rogers of the Tigers. Get some Tigers love. Uh, how far are they going to make in the playoffs, man? They are so hot right now. Oh, you got to love it. Oh, there's the Cubs killer, Joey Voto. No one likes him. There we go. Uh, there's Robbie Grossman. Retro Robbie loves Robbie Grossman. Uh, X Tiger. There's Mookie Bats. Everyone loves Mookie. And there's our pink parallel card. Another retro player. We got the Larry Bird of baseball there. We got Robin Young. Oh, the Milwaukee Brewers there. I, I do love these hot pink uh, retail insert cards. They're kind of cool. Oh, you go. Show the price. Show the odds of the Ro Robin Young, Larry Bird of baseball. And there's Old Man Kershaw himself. So he has a his single print. That's his regular card of Old Man Kershaw. So there you go. Oh, uh, here we go. Here's Ron Acuna Matata Jr. There. You got to love Acuna Matata. Oh, uh, are we going? Nope, we're going to get another a good old flashback. There you go. That's a terrific time there for the New York Mets. Strikeout season. Yep, yeah, there it is. Good old terrific time Seaver of the Mets. That guy was dominant in the 70s, man. You got to love it. A terrific time there. Getting a baseball flashback. So there we go. Getting a little something different. Each one. We haven't gotten a zoo card yet. Looking for that zoo card. You know, that kind of stupid, but hey, I need it for my set. Uh, looks like we're going to get something here. And we are going to get a <laughs> zoo card. There's a catfish. What team is that supposed to be? Catfish there. The zoo cards. Oh, catfish hunter. So there you go. Uh, there is Catfish Hunter right there. His animal version of Catfish. Uh, there you go. Got the zoo card there. Good old Catfish Hunter of Oakland A's back in the day. So there you go. There's the literal Catfish of the zoo cards. And we're going to get a single print. So double insert in here of Merrill Kelly of the Arizona Diamondbacks. So loving those single prints. Number 87 there. You know I need it. Now there we go. Uh, let's go. Let's find out what else we get in here. Well, this is the second box it definitely has a little more zip to it, I think. 
Uh, there's more Manny Machado. Oh, uh, and we're gonna we're gonna get a shiny card in here. So this that box is definitely better. Uh, who are we gonna get here for our shiny cards from the Cleveland Guardians? There is a hippy dippy refractor card. It says Guardians, but it's for the Mets. I don't think uh, Jermaine Colorado played for the <laughs> the Candyman. Did not play for the Guardians, so that might be an air card. Uh, I don't know if it is a uncorrected error or what, but the Candyman did not play for the Guardians, I recall. So, it's supposed to play for the Reds, but we got a Hippie Debbie Refractor card there. Numbered, what's that, number two? Number 82, uh, 375. So, a nice lower print one. Take your gummies, get a Hippie Debbie trip. Oh, and that messed up. It's hip. It's tripped out because it's supposed to be the Reds, not the Guardians there. So, ah, uh, yes. Tops and their quality control lately is something to be desired. So, well, we kind of got a sweet, sweet box out of here. So, I'm not going to complain too much. It's another Francisco. Oh, but unfortunately, I think this one's going to... No, nope, we're going to get something in there. We're going to get a new age performer there. A Boba Shet there. Boba Shet there. From the... Uh, Toronto Blue Jays there. So there you go for you Blue Jays fans there. There's Bobo Bichette. Uh, very nice. Uh, new Age Performer. Show the price. Show the odds. All right, let's pack Mojo. Let's not hope for an Ace of Base. Uh, I think the last box, we got two Ace of Bases. So hopefully we don't get an Ace of Base. Nope, we're going to get a single print card here. So here we go. Uh, let's go. Let's get to see if that last card's going to be... And it is going to be a single print card there. Another Tigers. Get some Tigers love there. Oh, Carson Kelly. I'll get some Tigers love. Unfortunately, he got traded. Uh, he was a midseason trade there at the trade deadline there. But there you go. Get some Tigers love there. Oh, Carson Kelly. Oh, the Tigers. Now of the Rangers. So there you go. So not too bad. Um, again, we did pretty decent there. We got that hippy dippy whacked out card there. Number 82, a 375 there. The candy man there. Uh, we got a catfish there. You got to love the catfishes. And let me sort this out quick a minute. Uh, good variety of cards. Oh, uh, we got three new age performers out of that stack here. So three new age performers. We got then and now. Oh, there's a good then and now and a baseball flashback. Got that catfish. And what and we got the two beautiful pink borders of retro players of Robin Young and Thurman Munson in there. So very nice. And of course, you can't forget the single prints. We did end up with six. So again, you know, the blaster boxes are a great way to get your single print cards. I always never discourage people getting blaster boxes. And you just never know what you're going to get inside of this stuff. So what was your favorite card? The pink parallels? The hippy dippy goofy guardians reds cards? The wacky catfish card? Let me know. Let me know. Leave those comments. I try to open stuff up like this every week for you guys. I love my heritage. I hope you do too. So until next time everyone. Retro Robbie saying... Collect what you love.